Well, April is National Donate Life Month. It's a time to raise awareness about the importance of tissue, eye, and organ donations. And News 12's Marissa Marcelino spoke to a nonprofit Live On New York and an organ donor's family about this precious life-saving gift. If we were in need, if our family members were in need, if the people that we loved were in need, what would we want somebody to do? Live On New York facilitates organ donations from finding those in need to those who may be a match. With 9,000 New Yorkers currently waitlisted for a life-saving transplant, he encourages people to think about being a living donor or a tissue eye organ donor in the future. What we come into this world with, we, we don't need to leave with. And what we come into this world with could help others not have to leave this world. He says the heroic donations of Detective Wilbert Mora, who was killed in the line of duty in January, caused a much needed spike in donors. Saying in February alone, there was a 93% increase in organs transplanted and donors doubled from the year before. But many more are still needed. Organ donors can save up to eight lives. Um, a single organ donor. So in the case of Detective Mora, um, he saved five lives. Arlene Soto Vargas knows firsthand the impact of donating life and says it's helped heal her pain and let her son live on. Her son, Louis Angel Vargas, was killed in the Bronx back in 2017. While he was on life support, she worked with Live On New York to have his organs donated, including a life-saving kidney transplant to a co-worker's niece. I don't have him here, but I know that his heart is beating somewhere. His eyes, because I did eye donation, I did skin graft. You can find out more information on becoming an organ donor by visiting news12.com, numbers and links. Marissa Marcelino, News 12.